Hey guys, LangCC52 here. It is St. Patty's Day, so for this episode, I'm going to try to do the entire thing in my St. Patty's voice. And by that, I mean my Irish accent. Now, I don't know if it's actually Irish. That's just what I call it. So, I was going to try and show... Spin around really fast. I am going to show you some changes I've made um, over the weekend. It's Monday, the 17th, as I said. Um, so, I was going to try and do it one at a time, but I keep looking at them. So let's start over here. I tactfully lured a baby zombie up over here behind me, and I raised this, and he would not come over it. So I don't know if it's because there's fences over here. I guess if he walks over here, that'd be a one, two, three-ish block wall. I don't really know. Um, that's a change I made. Uh, nothing in here. This mold is really bad. I don't know what I'm going to have to do about it. It could be behind this painting, I guess, but I'm not going to break that down just now. I keep breaking it all, though, and it just keeps growing back. Um, some sort of... Sort of... Uh, exterminator may be necessary. You see that in my chat? I might turn that down a little bit. Um, that is a plug-in thinking that players are trying to cheat. And they're not. It's just, if you dig, like, really fast, it'll... Uh, I don't think you guys have seen me do it, but there'll be enough delay between the server and the console of the player that it will think the player is somehow cheating. Um, so you see my windows here. I decided I'm still not happy with them. I'm just gonna I'm gonna have to just deal with it. But you'll see these are gray and these are white. That's gray because it started gray, and it looks a lot better at night here. Whereas the white, not so much. It's kind of cool. Um, I don't like it during the day as much because it's still it gives kind of this washed out effect for all the colors Whereas the gray is darker, but I feel like the color shows up better um, Just anything that's white through white looks better. I think I think that's how it works um, This accent isn't working very good is it? I got it from the boondock Terrence you guys I'm sure you didn't hear what I said, so I'm not gonna repeat myself, but I'm just gonna alternate these um, two things I kind of like, I figure, good enough. Um, over here, you see these levers? These are powering these lights. Which I might change. I could change them to glowstone. I just thought the iron with the iron would look better. And by iron, I mean the black on there with the black on there. Um, I thought that was sticks because their name is blue now. Confuse me. Um, so I saw these on somebody else's channel. Um, I've linked him previously on the Play Minecraft uh, server, the very first video, B00100. Um, he got them from somebody else as well, but um, I wanted these in here because I'm not sure how to separate this room. And in fact, I don't think I like these. I might remove them. Um, they're good for light. I mentioned in the last episode that I was going to dedicate this to somebody. And that sign's not great, and the sign might actually move, but I'm dedicating this room to Opie because he was really the first person to help me with it. He gave me a bunch of quart that's carpet. He gave me a bunch of quartz and continued to give me more quartz. And he is just, on every single video I've posted, um, maybe not one or two of them. I don't think he said anything about the Sanctum stuff, but that's besides the point. He's said stuff, and he's just encouraged me to keep recording. So I appreciate it. Appreciate that, uh, Obi. Um, another thing I want to show you was um, probably this thing. Now it might be kind of strange from down here. You can kind of see what's going on if I walk over this direction. Um, let's hop up to the top. Actually, I can get up there from here. Maybe. I'm going to be recording some MC underscore rain later. So I'll call you when those are done recording. What a dick. Does he think I'm going to be up till 1 in the morning again? He's mistaken. I can get up here. I did it a second ago. All right, so let's walk over here. There we go. That. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? That's a Cheshire face. I got rid of my name because it was covered by this circle thing. And I figured, hey, Cheshire face. I was thinking maybe kind of just like an open sort of like a globe Shakespeare theater kind of thing. Just looking straight into the sky would be cool. But I thought, hey, I have the circle here. It's mostly a circle. It's also off center, which is driving me crazy. I'm pretty sure I fixed it before, but really, the plan here is for somebody on the server to see what is going on here and to fix it. Look at these eyes. They're not even centered. What's going on?
the eyes are centered on that face, which isn't centered. So that's a upsets me. So these zombies, they don't even come for me. Let's get some iron. They all go for the villagers. So I guess that would work unless a villager gets in there. So we're going to, actually I didn't have a plan for today. I just wanted to say hi. Happy St. Patty's Day. I'm um, sure you keep, keep you updated. It, I can do a lot more work, I think, um, if as long as I show you guys, because I'll do something, I'll be like, I don't want to make any more changes to that until I see. I moved the beacon, it's centered more now. Um, this one has jump boost too, and this one has jump boost too. A huge problem I've been having since I built it is, um, well, not so much a problem now that I have these windows built in. See, that, that doesn't look too bad. I like how bright it is. Um, I don't like how the black looks from the inside, the, the roof. I'll show you in a sec. Um, uh, but the gray is not so bad either. It's so clear. So, oh, let's harvest this wheat. Um, the stone is working on her level 100 goal. So she came over and she bred my sheep a little bit. And then I went AFK to record some videos with sticks. And she asked to come over again. And I was not here. Um, as an owner, I don't get kicked for AFK. Which, um, let me tell you the story. I was playing Minecraft last night. I, I, I should have been asleep. But I decided, hey, I'm just going to get on for a little while. Tweak some things. And uh, sticks got on. He's like, hey. I know we haven't been able to get the Risk of Rain server to work, but let's let's give it another shot. And it worked. So I went straight from sitting in a in I was actually AFK booth right here. Um to record on Risk of Rain. And we did that for like three hours, I wanna say. And as soon as we were done recording, I was tired. It was about twelve thirty and I usually go to bed at nine so I can get up at four fifty in the morning. And uh alright, that's enough of that accent. Oh, this is another thing I wanted to show you. Yeah, what do you think? What do you think? I carved down this mountain a little bit. I might want to work on that hill a little more. It's still kind of steep, but it's all just covered. And I threw some glowstone down there. I thought it would give it some um, ambience. And maybe when it's nighttime, I can turn my brightness down. It'll look cooler. Um, look at that waterfall. That's pretty sweet, huh? I threw that in there. Not really any changes otherwise. There's levers on the outside of the building, which is a good reason to get rid of those lights. Um, I was telling you about Risk of Rain. Anyway, I thought I had quit the game. And what it is, is, um, I don't know that you guys can see my cursor, so I'm going to try and describe it. Um, pretend this is Minecraft. This is the X button. And then this wood here is like my desktop. I got the start menu and then a few icons. My Minecraft launcher is next to the, like, the file like all the user files thing. Minecraft launcher here. Minecraft game is actually over here when it loads. And I have everything else going, like Steam and um, Fraps. And Skype is on right now. Um, so before I went to sleep, I'm tired. I look down at the Minecraft block instead of the crafting table because the block is the launcher. The table is the game. And block was close. So I was like, all right. So I'm at work today. And it's break time. So this is like... Actually, not that long. It's like, let's see, 1 o'clock. It's only like 8 hours, maybe 7. Um, I look on the die map just, just for fun, just doing owner things, you know? And Rebel was on, and I was like, hey. Oh, I was also on. <laughs> I looked at the, uh, pardon me, one second, look, clear my throat. I was talking to Rebel, and I saw that I was on, and I was like, Oh crap, well, what's going on? Because I didn't play on my laptop, um, so it couldn't be on there, and I thought I had turned it off here, which obviously, now that I'm telling you the story, was not the case. Um, so, I was like, hey, have I been on all day? And he's like, yeah, you've been AFK since I got on. And I was like, oh crap. And I'm like, I don't know how to kick myself. But, thankfully, Odin has provided me with the tools to log into the server stuff, and I was able to kick myself in the game. Um... And the reason you're not allowed to AFK for more than, I think it's 25 minutes, is because the more people that get on, the more resources it takes from the server. 
And so if one person is just on constantly, not doing anything, it's just a waste of resources. Other people will get lag, and there's no good reason for it. So I managed to kick myself, but when I came back just a few minutes ago, um, unfortunately, I didn't record it. Um, thankfully, I came back vanished, which is just invisible. I log in that way. Um, I went this way and I heard a sound. I turned around and there were just hundreds of arrows in like this, this little four block area. And there was a skeleton sitting over there. I took a screenshot of it. Let me see. Um, I've tried to insert screenshots before. I'll give it a shot right here. Now I cut the video there so I would remember later that I'm trying to insert a screenshot. But um, a lot of arrows there would have most definitely killed me had I not been banished. Um, I found two more gold when I moved the beacon. I replaced, like like I said, I think just two gold with uh, iron. Yeah. So I can, I can work on this. I would like a bigger grid to wake up on when I plant my feet on the warm. I like to think the gold is warm. Um, oh, you guys don't know about this. This hole right here is just solid glass all the way to the bottom. Now at the very bottom there's going to be lava, and on top of the lava is going to be a little bit of quartz. Actually, no, it might have just been all glass. I think it was all glass or quartz, whatever I was doing. Um, and my bed was going to be there. Now the theory here was when I would wake up, I would spawn right here, because that's the first solid block for the bed to spawn on. And I thought that's how it worked, but either the server couldn't handle doing that for me or something else was wrong, because I would just spawn and then fall and die. Which is why I don't sleep there. Um, you guys didn't see this. I'm. This wood is a bit dark. That's why I was recording too. I'm gonna replace it with spruce because it's just it's too contrasting to leave there. Um, so I'm gonna change that out with spruce. No, not really any other changes otherwise. Um, Risk, you guys. This is going to most likely go up before Risk of Rain. Um, there's two episodes we recorded. Second one, I don't know how the entire video was, but right at the end, I think it was really funny. I was listening to myself um, just say some things, and I sounded not what I'm used to hearing. So that was, that was pretty funny. But you guys will have to check that out to see what I'm talking about, because I don't want to give it away for people who want to check it out anyway. Oh, and for those of you who are watching this video and don't know what Risk of Ra Rain is, it is a roguelike game. So when you die, you just start over. But, oh, I planted trees. Oh, you guys may have noticed. I planted trees all over the place. Um, I took all my saplings. or I took a lot of saplings. And I planted them all. Uh, I didn't actually end up having very many. So I went and bought, like, a stack of each sapling. Um, dark oak trees and jungle trees don't last as long because they're uh, two by two trees. These look really nice with all the leaves now, though. I'm thinking once the forest is dense enough, I can jump on the trees and travel that way. So let's look at my sheep. Um, they're not quite together enough for me to be happy with releasing them. Those cows need to go in a pen, actually. Hmm. I'll have to figure out a way to separate everything. I might just have to do it one at a time with leads which actually might not work either because I'd have to get the cows out without getting the sheep out. Actually, I don't mind if the sheep escape. I can still breed them. Oh, 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 before I forget, I have one name tag. Obi, um, thanks again, Obi, uh, instructed me in the ways of Minecraft. And I don't remember everything he said. It was all very important. Um, that's not where it's at. But you can make Jeb sheep. So let's go find my anvil. It's under Mr. Notch. Sticks. No, that's Sentinel. Sorry. I'm so sorry, Sentinel. Whew. Hi, Sticks. Alright, so. Name tag. Now, I'm pretty sure it's Jeb underscore, and I asked last night, I believe. Oh, it's all lowercase, too. I think. If not, I can rename it. Actually, I can't really. Is that just one underscore? I'm so nervous, you guys. Let's see if this works. All right. Let's go throw this on a sheep. That doesn't look right to me, but we'll find out. Um, I thought I had a bunch of these, but it turns out 
I don't have a bunch of name tags. I have a bunch of saddles. Another good one. Oh, the um, head game. First success. Obi, Obi co commented it on it first. Um, Reb found it as well. It was, uh, I'll show you guys actually in case you're new to the video and you don't recognize the rooms just yet. I've got two of them. There's the library and the Resident Evil room. Everything else is just kind of open space. I guess that circle room is almost a room now. Um, I might I might take the face out, you guys. I'd really like to put it there, but I'm not sure I'm going to be happy with how it looks. I really like this aca these acacia trees, though. The, the leaves look really nice in this biome. So there's a skeleton. I don't want to kill my stuff. Let's find a brown sheep or a gray sheep. Let's do brown. There's so many brown. Yeah, that makes me sad. Well, I guess I'll need another name tag. Be right back. I'm back, you guys. I bought another name tag and then I realized something. Um, can you guys see it? Have you noticed it? It took me a little while. Right there. Look at that. Alright, so I have another name tag and I have a few levels, so let's go to bed. I can't speak and type at the same time. Um, so let me tell you what happened. A few days ago, Sticks and I were trying to do a recording, and he was using an older version of Minecraft um, because of Bucket for his, his server. We were doing something on that server. Um, and I never changed my profile from that. So I was at like 1.6.4 or 1.6.5 or something. And the server runs at 1.7.4, I think. But that's why the gem sheep didn't work. So as soon as I hit it, bam, look at that. That I'm gonna have a few of you scattered around. I would love to find one of those naturally. That would be the coolest thing in the world. Just be walking along. Oh, a pink sheep. Oh, it's a blue sheep. Oh my god, it's cyan. Um, but yeah, so that was a problem. I just had to change to 1.7.5, which is when this was in, this feature was introduced, and that worked. Um, there's also one for Grum, and I don't remember the other guy's name just because it's not as easy to remember as Grum. But if you name a mob that, they will be upside down. Upside down. Any mob. I don't think you can name Ender Dragons, but I could be mistaken about that. I probably shouldn't say things that I don't know for sure. So, no progress on the little thing down there. The PvP arena. Um, I've stolen a whole bunch of glass from it, though. Um, for my bubble island. As well as the ravine over here. So now that it's night, actually, how much time do we got? Run out of time. We gotta get to that ravine quick. So let's. I'm trying, you guys. I'm running. It's so quiet. It's quiet. Happy St. Patty's Day, guys. Um, yeah, I should have a beer. I haven't drunk in a while, but uh, I should see if that beer's any good. I haven't drunk in a while, and I've had beer since I stopped drinking. So, I should see if that has any sort of expiration date or something I turned 22 next month so I only started drinking last year so I don't know much about the uh, the alcohols Let's see look at that oh oh look at that oh look how beautiful that abyss is. Oh, okay um, the glowstone is a lot brighter than I thought it might be I just kind of ran around in there and placed it places uh, it might look better if I had hidden it some more let me Let's do it 40. See how the game looks that way. Ooh, that's that's kind of spooky. All right, all right, that's cooler. Still, it's really visible, so that takes away from it some. I just kind of shoved it in places where there were holes. I shoved my glowstone into holes. Um, I grew up next to a power plant. Oh, haven't done that in a while. Click. <laughs> All right, brightness, moody. I thought it was gloomy. That's a lot prettier. It's a lot nicer with all that lighting. Water. Water. There is water here. 
I'm sorry, it's so quiet, guys. I've been, I was listening to them. I don't know if you can even hear it through your speakers or headphones. If you're wearing headphones, you probably can. Um, no, 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 no. That's great. I don't know why they did that, but that is the best thing in the world. Um, something that's really awesome is hearing Enderman in the rain. Oh! That's great. Look at that sunrise. Not so great. Kind of just fizzled out. Really, I would like to have these empty, but I also want windows there. I just want clear windows. I don't want to modify anything, though. I don't want to go download Optifine or change my texture pack or use a texture pack. You know what? I don't have any texture packs. I was going to switch out. There were a few I talked about um, in a video several back, several videos back when I first showed you guys this one that I can't even hear now because I'm talking so loud. Um, there we go. Um, I never went and downloaded any of them. They're just sitting on my laptop, existing. But this this was mostly an update video, you guys. Um, just had a few things to show you so I can make more progress. I gotta figure out what happened here because it should be. I don't know which one of these. It's the outer circle. I should go one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. One, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, one, one. It's just this thing in the. Th this room here is in the way. Obi, why'd you have to put this room here? Um. That table. I should. I should figure out a room. I've got so many things to do, guys. I should. Um. Um. make a list whoa sticks just why don't you lead up to it just kind of ease your way up to that you just too much uh, um oh you guys you know what there was a new machine I was gonna make today so I will just tell about tell, it, tell you about it because I actually didn't think about how to make the machine I'm gonna have to look that up um, What a wuss. Um, being an owner, I'm gonna hide most of the most of the background stuff, um, stabilities, the things that should be kept secret. I fixed these stairs. Um, I don't know if anybody noticed that, but one of these was just wrong, and I fixed it. And that's not pretty. But if I change the stairs or add them, it just looks strange. So that's gonna stay that way. Yeah. Um, but anyway, if I go to do some sort of owner task, I might need to use World Edit and the wand, which is a wooden axe. Um, all, all the items I would use as an owner are no big deal. I could throw them in a hole. I could burn them. I could I could keep them, and it would it wouldn't make much of a difference in as far as survival goes. But I made this just so I could keep them separate. And um, the next machine I want to do is, you see how this is called Quick Drop? That's called Quick Drop because I went to do something for like an event or something. And I just dumped everything into it. Everything in my inventory except some food. So what I want to do as an owner is if somebody needs something, I need to go over there, do world edit, need to stop something from killing the server I want to run over to a booth probably on like a second story or may maybe not I might be able to make it super easy and just dump everything in my inventory in it just shift click everything into it and have it suck it all into a bunch of dispensers and then I want to run into this booth from a different angle and let me let me show you real quick I think I got time um, that last video where I was really really tired um, It must have been like Saturday, you guys. I had a weird weekend um, as far as sleep goes. I haven't done that in a while. So no fences here. They're probably in the thing that says fence. All right, so if you take a fence, 
to the things I say. I don't care. Um, just tell me about it in the comments. Redstone. I know I labeled these things. I don't look in the right places. So you take a fence, and you take five pressure plates. I'm going to take one. Click. All right. So this pressure plate will activate. Do I have? I've only got a few more lights. It'll activate this square, 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 and everyone above that square. And I think if I put something here, even it will send a current through that and it might activate another block up here let me here let's grab a redstone torch i got the chest right here i think i still got time okay so that's not where i want to put it redstone torch click no good click no good let's see if this actually works all right i'm just full of it i could be mistaken about this um, well, in the event this works later when I try to use it, I could just run to this booth and all these dispensers could shoot my inventory back into me. I don't even care if it's in the right order, just as long as I have it. Right order would be preferable though, though which really all that it might take to do that is unloading it in the right order, like sword, armor, whatever first. Um, but that's a job for another episode. This circle is going to probably drive me about as crazy as that glass. The pattern over here is random. Um, I tried not to have the same colors touching each other. I, I did try like lines, um, weird lines, crazy lines, really long lines, but just a standard pattern didn't work. So I'm trying to make it random. There's only so much you can do with three colors though. Um, it was just purple and red and I didn't like that. In the movie, I'm pretty sure Ch Cheshire Cat, or in the, the Disney movie, the new one, Cheshire Cat has a bunch of cyan, which looks really cool, but my skin is based off the old one. And actually, I'm really excited. I always confuse myself about F5. I'm really, really excited for the new um, skin stuff because I'm hoping somebody will update the skin. I didn't make this skin. I don't think I ever linked where I found the skin either. I had to download it again, I believe. Um, that has nothing to do with anything I'm talking about except kind of it's writing um but an update on this skin would be fantastic i like to change stuff but i really like this skin so i'm going to find a nice place to take a picture what do you, what do you guys think i can i can catch a bunch of changes all at once that's it's not very pretty let me take off my uh, that's not the inventory i've been doing that for like the past three days i'll hit escape instead of inventory so there's me Ooh, i gotta get my axe in there i like to carry around an axe that's relative to the thing and everybody say cheese cheese there we go oh there's rain in there and everything so natural so thank you guys for watching hopefully this didn't run long again like all my other videos seem to except for the last one which was almost perfect um uh I'm pretty sure I thank you for watching, but I would like to do it again. Thank you, Obi, um, for all your help and the, the motivation. Obi's not the only one who gives me props on my videos and say they like them. Uh, a lot of people on the server do, Sant Reb, uh, Boy Wonder, who put out another hardcore video a few days ago. I guess he's, he's playing with some modded stuff now, so that'll be cool to see um, if, if he records that. But uh, Apparently, Crippled Hobo is also supposed to put out another video soon. You know, I'm doing this thing where I try to say goodbye and I just talk forever. In fact, I should start saying goodbye at the beginning of the episode, and maybe by the end it'll be the right amount of time. Anyway, glass, that gray. God damn it, Reb. Um, I love you guys. Bye. I almost forgot. Happy St. Patrick's Day.